channel. Um, I'm actually on a two-stop load. Um, I'm sitting parked waiting um, my time to go and, and deliver to my O2. I'm currently in Connecticut. I picked up this load in Ohio. Um, Worcester, Ohio. So my first stop is um, about three miles away from where I am currently. And then after that, I gotta go to Dayville, Connecticut. This load is paying me $2.55 per mile. Um, total miles in this load was about 800. Yeah, about 800 miles. So when I picked up the load in Ohio, um, to go to my 01, the miles was like 500 and something. So um, I made it about, I'm at a TA right now. And um, excuse me, I'm my neck is like killing me right now. So excuse me if I'm not so jumpy like I usually am. So I'm currently getting ready to do my um, trip sheet like now. So, cause I tend to forget to do it and I'm always getting a message um, asking to turn in my trip sheet so I'm gonna do that with you guys now I don't know if you ever saw one of our, our primes uh, trip sheets but this is what it looks like um, what you do is you just fill it out this will be your your truck number this will be your trip number you'll fill in all of the information required right here and then you'll take a picture of it and you'll uh, submit it but don't forget to put your status if you're an owner operator a company driver whatever you got to check one of these boxes so I'm gonna fill it out and then I'm gonna let you know I'm gonna let you see what it looks like Trip number two one seven five two six four. Driver name, that's me. I'll just write in my full name right here. My driver code, which will be somewhere on the screen. Um, the state that I originally picked up this load uh, they want you to add that now since this is a two-stop load I'm gonna have to do two trip sheets so this is the first uh, trip sheet so I will put my first destination which is Cheshire Connecticut now the delivery date for this is today, obviously. And today is my daughter's birthday. Today is the 12th of June. And my pickup date for this load was the 10th. So I'll put that in the pickup date um, portion. I'll add my trailer number, which is 230. 005 and the customer's name is Daisy now this place has no overnight parking so I'm trying to wait until the last minute I'm supposed to deliver by 1150 something according to my uh, paperwork I'm gonna try to sign my paperwork now because I didn't get a chance to and be back after these messages
finish my paperwork. Um, this is what it looked like, all filled out. I got that right next to my bills. So, since this is a two, being that this is a two stop load, I have um, my seal on the, the back for the first stop. So when I go to my um, O2, I'm gonna cut that seal off, open the doors, and then when they finish unloading those, um, let me see how many pallets they got. So they'll get like 22 pallets, I believe. And then the last place gets two pallets. Yeah, they get two pallets. And then after they, after the, um, the O2 takes you know their stuff off of my um trailer i will put the next seal on which is right here and then after i do that i'll go about 75 miles to my 90. and then um i'll be done just wait for my next load um this load is paying two thousand and something $2.55 a mile, that's awesome. Because I was just in Texas and that load was only paying me a dollar and sixty-two cents per mile, which kind of sucked because my um fleet manager was on vacation. And I kind of hate when he's not in because I always tend to get crappy loads when he's not there. But you know, they always say, oh, fright is bad. Tis the season for bad loads. It's gonna pick up shortly. I'm waiting because when I first got here, the loads were popping. Um, I was getting loads that was um, paying over five grand. So I don't know, but I'm gonna keep you guys um, updated. Um, as I said, I will be uploading uh, one to two videos um, every week from now on. Um, if you haven't already, please thumbs me up. Leave me comments. Y'all don't like to leave me comments. Y'all always in my inbox, but y'all don't want to leave me comments. I see my views is picking up really well, and I really appreciate you guys for um, tuning into my videos, even though I've been gone for a while. Um, I just been dealing with the loss of my husband. It's actually been a year now since um, my husband passed. And I know you guys been waiting for a video about that as well. But when I'm ready, I will talk about it. Um, I'm not ready right now because it's just too much. But anyway, um, it helps my um, YouTube pro promote my videos when um, the algorithm, is that how you say it? Algorithm? It's good. Um, the views. I need the views for YouTube to push my video forward and for the brand um, content to come back. Because I've been gone for a while and I haven't been able to check my email because I've been going through some stuff. So if you have been um, trying to contact me to uh, collab with me, um, just, you know, keep trying to reach out um, to me. Um, I will be, I have been checking my email and I have been responding to the people that i worked with in the past and the people that currently want to work with me. So um, stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. I love you. Hey, my beauties. So um, if I look pissed, it's because I am. I'm at my 90 um, UNFI in Connecticut. I absolutely hate this place. Um, when I got here, um, it was about 3.30 in the morning. Today is the 13th, mind you. It's the day after my daughter's birthday. Um, this place, like, I don't wanna come back here. Like, don't send me back here. Prime, if you're watching this, don't send me back here. Because this place, I went in the receiving office 
after I made my um my lumber my lumper payment and the lady behind the desk was just not paying any attention to me so um I'm sitting here I'm the last person here and I got here first um I'm still in the door um they tell you don't um pull out the door until you get your um paperwork so I went in there I, I made my lumper payment and I'm like why am I the last one here? And there's people that came and backed into the docks next to me, after me. And what is it? 9.30? 2 a.m.? And I'm still here? Like, I don't know what the hell is going on with this place. But that lady, she, I went in there and I'm like, um, hello, can I get my bills? And she's like, just doing what she's doing with the paperwork i paid my lumper fee two hours ago and i'm still sitting here like i don't know what the hell these people got going on but this is totally unfair and i don't like this place so i won't be coming back here um after well they usually send you a text message and after the text message um, you know, to let you know that your, your, um, payment was successful or whatever. And then, um, they'll send you another message, um, for like a survey or something. I gave them zeros. If there was like a negative zero, they would have got that because this is ridiculous. Like, why do you just have me sitting here and all of the other people, um, that got here after me is gone. And there's like new people coming in here back and indoors. Will they be gone before me too? Like I'm pissed. This don't make no sense. Y'all need to do better.